How do I make money with a directory website? Well, let me show you how. In front of me, we have the premium press directory theme. So this is the demo and I'll include the link to download this theme in the description below. This theme is unlike any other WordPress products you've seen. And by the end of this video, you'll understand why. So let me show you five different methods for making money with a directory website. The first method for making money with a directory website is via the use of what we call business listings. And these are dedicated pages on your website which promotes that business and drives traffic to their business place or website. So let me show you what that looks like in practice. In front of me we have the directory theme and on the home page we have some featured businesses. So if I preview one of these businesses, this is what we call a business listing page and it provides all of the information about that business so the user can go ahead and contact them or learn more about them. So we have things like the actual title, reviews, about us, photos and videos, the location, opening hours, amenities, services, etc, etc. So as you can see here, there's a lot of information that the business can add to your website to promote themselves to your visitors. Now, for the privilege of adding this listing to your website, you can charge the business a monthly fee. So let me show you what that looks like. As a new business, I might want to come to your website and create a listing. And these listing prices, etc., are completely customizable. And I'll show you how to change those in a moment. So you can do things like allow the user to add a free business listing, or you can charge them a one-time fee, or you could charge them a monthly fee. So let me give you an example of pricing. If I just take a look at this potential income chart, this illustrates how much money you can earn if you charge a $50 monthly fee for a business listing on your website. So just $50. And let's just say you have 25 businesses. Now, if you take a look at the chart, we can see this is a monthly income of $1,250. So that's monthly, just for 25 listings, which is an annual income of $15,000. Now, let's say you have an average of 100 users. So that's 100 businesses listing their website on your. Now, that's a monthly income of $5,000 with over $60,000 a year. So that's a lovely little side income just from a single website. Now let's look how to customize these and set our own prices. So we go to the admin area, we click on premium press, we click on listing settings, and as you can see this option called pricing tables. Now here we can add up to 10 different packages and to edit any of them, simply click on the name and we can change all of the options. We can change the icons, the actual name, we can change the price, we can set up reoccurring, we can set it to be highlighted, and obviously allow the user to have different options built into this package. So you can completely customize all of the package options via the add me option here. Now one of the great benefits of a business adding a listing to your website is that they can completely manage the business listing themselves. So you don't have to do any of the work. Basically, they can log into their own dedicated members area and modify this listing at any time. So they can change their own text just by clicking on the buttons. They can add new images. They can update their opening hours, etc. So all the information on this page can be completely customized by the actual business. So there's no interaction from you. You don't need to do anything. You just sit back and collect your monthly recurring payment. The next method for making money on your direct website is with the use of what we call listing upgrades. And this helps the business upgrade their listing to give more exposure and more traffic to their actual listing page. So let me show you what that looks like in practice. If we go back to our example listing here, as the business, I might want to upgrade my listing to have more exposure and drive more traffic to my website. And I can do that just by editing the listing. And on the right hand side, we have what we call listing upgrades. And these are promotions that the um, business listing owner can pay extra for to have displayed on their website. So for example, the user might want a featured banner to visually make the listing more appealing. And we could add that to my actual listing for $10. I can set my sponsored, which means it'll be displayed at the top of my search results. That's a $50 option. Or I can be displayed on the home page for $100. So let me give you an example. If I click on my home page, the featured businesses here on the home page, you can set that as a homepage upgrade option here. So by the user purchasing this option here, they will then be displayed in this section here. So the user can do this at any time they want their listing to be upgraded. They can just click on the option, upgrade it, use the purchase options to purchase and pay for it now. What's great about this is that the actual business owner can visually see 
how long they have left on this upgrade. So as you can see here, I have 30 days in total and it's counting down to the actual day that the listing expires. So again, let me show you how to customize and set up these packages. You can go to the admin area view theme, click on premium press, click on listing settings, click on pricing tables, and we scroll down, you can see listing promotions are at the bottom. So here you can set your own custom pricing for each and every one and the duration of the actual package. What a lot of users are doing, and this is a quick tip, what a lot of people are now doing is using this section with free listings. So what they're doing is rather than charging business owners to create um, the listing, they're allowing the business owners to create a free listing and then simply charging for listing upgrades. So that's just something extra you might want to consider. The next method for making money with your direct website is via the use of memberships. Now a membership provides access to your website for either exclusive content or for a limited period of time. So let me show you what that looks like in practice. If we take a look again at our directory website and we click on the membership options, this is a sample pricing table um, using membership options. And if I show you in the user's account, so this is the account area that all of your users get. They can then view the memberships on the left here or on the right hand side here. So it's the same page. And here you can see any of the membership packages that you've created via the admin area. And all of the membership packages can be customized and I'll show you that in a moment. Memberships can have different features, different access to certain pages on your website, etc. So memberships are very different to listing packages. Listing packages refer only to that listing page itself, whereas a membership you can bundle in the option for users to create multiple listings as part of the actual membership. So let me show you how to customize this pricing. We go to the admin area of your WordPress website, click on premium press, click on memberships, and this section allows you to completely control how memberships are controlled on your website. For example, you can set up free memberships, add extra time, force memberships, which requires users to actually purchase a membership before they can log into your website. Uh, and you can have up to 10 different membership packages, but generally speaking, three is enough. And clicking on any of the name options here gives you lots of different options to customize all of your listing options. Now, rather than uh, go through them one by one, I'm just gonna quickly show you what a lot of people are now doing on the directory theme. If we go back to the actual website, rather than charging to add a business, so what they are usually doing is turning off packages, they're actually just charging users to access the entire website via a membership. And you can then bundle those in with membership options. So if you click on any of the membership, you can allow um, the options called free listing credit, which means you can say, for example, join a membership and you can create 20 different business listings for that one membership fee. So it's another way of making money using your directory website. The next method for making money with your directory website is via the use of paid advertising. And this entails things like putting banner adverts on your website or using AdSense. So let me quickly show you what that's all about. If I take a preview of again at our directory website and I view any of my listings, we have a built-in um, advertisement system called CellSpace. As you can see here on the right hand side, the user can click and purchase banner space on my actual website. Now all these banner space can be completely customized again by the admin area and you can use either user listings or you can add AdSense or your own custom banner code. So let me quickly explain, if I go to the admin area, click on premium press, click on advertising and add a new campaign, I can select multiple different locations and under cell space you can see all the options we have so we can have banners in the header, the footer, etc. And as you can see there's a price next to each one. So I can charge um, advertisers to come to my website and purchase banner space on my website. So rather than charging, for example, users to add content to your website, you can allow all of users to add business listings, etc., completely free, but instead you can use that traffic and then generate payment via actual banner advertising instead. If you're using AdSense, again, you can put AdSense in all of the ad spots on your website, and we have a dedicated video on adding AdSense to your premium press team on our YouTube channel, so check out that as well. And finally, the last method for making money with a direct website is via the use of what we call email marketing, which I'm sure you probably all heard about. It's by sending promotional emails, etc., to your members. So if we take a look at our website, we scroll down the bottom, we have things like a newsletter sign-up form and obviously your member information when they join your website. 
In the admin area of our Premium Press team, we have a built-in email system. So you can use the email option here. And there's lots of options available. We can change the system email, system options, and we have the built-in newsletter system here. So you can send emails to all of your users or to a single email directly, and you can set up custom subscription options, newsletter options, etc. So this is a great way of adding extra income to your website. You could obviously use this method in conjunction with other options. So for example, you can still charge for your listing packages, etc. And then you could send out a monthly email with uh, promotional codes or discounts, etc. And what a lot of people are also doing is joining affiliate systems and then promoting that to the website users so they can earn an extra income as well on top of that. So there we go, five different methods for making money with a directory website. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and a like and I'll keep creating content just like this one. Thanks again and I'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.